Hey guys, Tay from Florida here. And I'm out at uh, Historic Bayport, Florida. And came out today in search of one thing and was able to find it. Back in the 1860s, the Confederate Army had a base here, or a port here. Um, that sole purpose was to transport uh, cotton and meat to the northern ports for the Confederate Army. And uh, they had some side, steam-powered uh, side paddle wheel ships that would uh, come in here into the shallow waters, which the Union Army could not make it in here because it was too shallow. So at one more time during one of the two attacks that took place out here, the uh, Confederate Army decided to go ahead and uh, submerge one of the vessels and uh, one of them was captured. So the remnants of this are the boilers that are out here. These actually were out in the water and over the years washed up in here. Most likely the ship, this is back in the 1860s, most likely this ship was actually older than 1860. But I don't have an exact date for you on that one. And it's kind of covered up, so I hope this is coming out fairly decent. Let's go across here a little bit. And uh, there's another, another piece here, so. You can see through there also. So there you have it. Anybody's interested in the history of Bayport? I'll put a link up to uh, so you can look at some history of it.